Hey guys, it's Anna here. I'm a freelance illustrator and newbie content creator. Welcome to my channel. While the rest of the world is going through summer, um, it's actually winter here in Australia right now. So I've been getting back into some of my cozy hobbies, which usually include some form of textile uh, hobby and gaming. Now, I'm not a huge gamer or anything, but I like to play games from time to time and I usually play on my phone, which is why I decided to share a handful of my favourite games in hopes that you'll enjoy them too. First game on my list is Pop Tropica. Now this is a very nostalgic game for me. Fun fact, I was homeschooled, um, so I used to like play this game in between my breaks. The game consists of a personal avatar and you're basically a traveller travelling on this map of different islands and each island has a um, mission so you're probably helping someone out or you know you've ended up in some trouble and you have to try and figure your way, figure your way out. Um, it's so much fun, you collect items, different outfits and clothing. And it's a game I really like to get lost in. Usually this is my go-to. The next game on my list is Cats and Soup. And it's basically a very simple game. You start off with one cat and slowly build up your cat collection and your soup making station by selling uh, your soup and making money. You can also add new facilities and take pictures of your cats doing different activities and there's a lot of customability with this game which I really like. This game is Animal Restaurant. It's a game I installed to prevent myself from scrolling through TikTok. The simple objective of this game is to basically run this restaurant efficiently by taking customers' orders. You get to upgrade your equipment and the dishes you get to serve as the game goes on. Next up is another nostalgic classic. This is Papa's Freezeria. There seems to be a theme with, with the games I play. Apparently, I really want to run a food cafe or store of some kind, which is really funny. But this game consists of you owning a shop, in this case it's a milkshake shop. You take a customer's order and then you go to the building station and then you slowly build up the customer's milkshakes. Now based on how perfect you get it, the customer is going to rate and review your milkshake and give you uh, tips and points accordingly. You then get to take said tips and build up your inventory and upgrade your equipment and even add decorations into your store. Now the customers vary so there are some customers that are easier than others. Definitely a game that keeps you on your toes. This last one isn't really a game per se but it's a character building app. Um, you get to customize an avatar of your choosing with different hairstyles, different hair colors, different clothing. The details are so intricate from the socks to the shoes. And so far, I've created an avatar for each member of my family. If you liked this video and would like to see more like it, be sure to like this video and add a little comment. And till next time, bye bye.